people here take huh? You see them huge? <sighs> wow. Piss will stop by one of the food stalls. So. What are we even doing here? No one in their right mind would go into a train graveyard at night. People talk, rumors spread, and kids get curious. You know how it is. Speaking of which, you hear it was supposedly a ghost, not a monster, that attacked that guy this afternoon? They must have been seeing things. Talk about weird stuff going down. A reactor bombing, a train graveyard getting closed off. What? The graveyard's closed? One of the locals was attacked by some kind of monster, so the watch told people to keep out. I'm going on a ghost hunt. Come on out, ghosts! Of course no one's here to pick me up. Why would they be? Why did my office have to burn down? We thought you were dead! Just seeing your faces. Are you crying? How about it, baby girl? How about what? someplace a little less crowded. Okay, except the only place around here is the train graveyard, which everyone says is haunted. But that's cool, right? Uh, brain check? Provide an update on the schedule first thing tomorrow morning. Thank you for your patience. Emergency train. When I put him in charge of my stand, I told him, son, the goal isn't to make a fortune. It's to make people happy. If someone's having a bad day, it's worth with a smile on their face. Well, by the looks of things, I'd say he took that lesson to heart. Hey, leftovers are for the kids only, dummy. So the Mako reactor's broken? Well, then you can fall in love with Fried Marsh all Back down over here. here? So, how much is enough Fried Marsh? Handful or... Hear me out. A whole heap? I wish I could tell you, but sadly, I don't they share your passion for the process. <laughs> I was pulling some OT when it happened. I've never felt the ground shake like that. What kind of person bombs a reactor? Avalanche. That sounds familiar. So I'm afraid he's only had it so good because of the reactors. And this bombing's changed all that. Yeah, well, mm -hmm. huh? I've never seen anything like it before. It was completely insane. Security was out full force looking for the bombers. I even saw a few helicopters. Wow, that sounds intense. Uh, it was like a giant candle lighting up the whole sky. Huh? Oh, Sector 8 was like a nightmare. nightmare. Fires everywhere. Huh. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Yeah, the hell it is. Goddamn eco warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steel work. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> what the? You okay, buddy? <laughs> Mako Junkie, huh? Figures. You again. Shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. 
When I get back, it's refueling time. Can you just get You don't want to mess with the boss, do you? Warning. Gate broken. Fiends in area. Exercise caution. No reason to check it out. Not my problem. Um, excuse me. Uh, due to an emergency, entry into this area is prohibited. Sorry for the inconvenience. You call that a warning? No, sir! In accordance with emergency regulations, entry into this area is prohibited. Please, leave at once. Still too nice! What do you know? That ain't half bad. I'll make a grease monkey out of you yet. Thanks. I've always dreamed of opening up my own shop. So I can look after my parents, you know? <laughs> Have you been a good girl? Yeah, I have to come for Tifa. <laughs> oh, you did, did you? Well, well. <laughs> you made it. <laughs> Where'd you get that? I can't remember the last time I saw a real one. <laughs> huh? <sighs> How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? A guy can change. Has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. Daddy, the Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV is talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? Uh. <laughs> hey! Uh, what the hell do you think you're doing scaring my daughter like that? Daddy says never talk to strangers. <laughs> That's right, honey. I do say that. What a good girl you are remembering Daddy's lessons. <laughs> you know what else good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. I want to talk some more, Daddy. Mm, all right, but just this once. <sighs> uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, right. About that. We should talk outside. <sighs> um, Daddy? Did the people who died all return to the planet? Of course. Let that be a lesson to you. When you want to talk to a little kid, don't go give another professional killer eyes.
Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. How was it up on the plate? It was chaotic. Sorry for dragging you into all this. It was wrong of me to put you in danger like that. I promise I won't do it again. Danger's part of the job. Don't worry about me. <laughs> I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shinra. <laughs> stick with me for now. I'll give you the grand tour later. So, you make nice with everyone? Much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. They'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells them to. One of my friends said so they saw it burning. It wasn't that bad? That reactors were it safe. was. Oh, right. And here we are. Good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with Seventh Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No. It's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. It's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it. There is one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <sighs> and you're sure about that? Of course, as long as you help, that is. Wait, then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. You're the best. I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. <sighs> It's time for introductions.
Hey, you okay in there? Oh. Coming in. But he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. Well now, you must be Cloud. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. Can be about anything, even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. saying they're gonna step up their game. Searching for candidates. No way we can afford the rent in our place. I'll start looking for a new one. Back to living in a dump somewhere. Is that who Wedge mentioned? The merchant? That sword's massive. What does he sell again? Don't want to get hurt. Keep your distance. Warning. Gate broken. Fiends in area. Exercise caution. No reason to check it out. Not my problem. That sword's massive. What does he sell again? Searching for candidates. Gotta stay focused. We keep putting off maintenance.
guy who lives over there's got a real hard on for me. I swear all the plate side jobs are one off gigs. No matter how hard I work, lots of girls who swear to have potential. One, two, ready? One, two, just like that. Bam! Nah, you got lucky. Yes! What's the source of all the money? How much do we need to buy a house? Good idea to stock up on food. Uh, there's this one dude in the watch who's like a genius. It's just me, or there are more strays around here these days. <laughs> there's this one dude in the watch who's like a genius. But didn't she send money back? I'm not gonna let you sleep all night. Huh? She you want to Think we could get some money if we strip this thing for parts? Looks damn near rusted through to me. I'm game as long as it buys us. Hmm. Have you asked your parents? They were saying there's parts of Sector. It's times like this. Uh -huh. hmm. The vacant lot up ahead is overrun with wild beasts. Best steer clear unless you're looking for trouble. Even if you are, be careful. Shops on Culvert Street, stop goods you won't find in the reputable establishments. Never ask folks about your suppliers. I'll have a little chat with you. out on my chance to live next door to T5.
Weapons all I've got these days. Hey man, check it out. This song's pretty sweet, ain't it? You like it? You feeling it? Have a copy. Danger. Falling debris. Keep out. Not going that way. Right, boss. It was those avalanche terrorists that bombed the reactor. We won't let them beat us. Not ever. Right. Once the trains are running, we'll head to the office and do whatever we can to help. That's how we can fight back against terrorism. Those bikes are reserved for someone tonight. Someone important. So make sure it's in top condition. Got it? Yeah, yeah, My yes, sister sir. on the plate came down to visit me, and she looked like a completely different person. So this is all avalanche's fault? Apparently, the Sectorate okay. Expressway oh, collapsed. Come on, give me a child run. Do your worst. I might have dinner at 7 Heaven tonight. Morning. Hey. Just so you know, Marlene's still asleep. <sighs> Let's get down to business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. <laughs> Although the next batch probably could, if Jessie put her mind to it. Most every home in the area has one. Folks love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, they make us more money than this place. And it's easy money, too. We bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? <sighs> Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you uh. say? Please? <sighs> Let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. and keep whatever we collect. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. Thanks. And don't worry. We'll pay you the difference after. Yeah. Barrett's out making his rounds, to too. Don't take your as eyes long off as I it. get it all to this. Hey there. Here to change out your water filter. Tifa, baby, how you doing? Been waiting for you to... Wait, who's he? Cloud's in charge of collections. He'll take your money. Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. In your dreams, maybe. Huh? Cloud! Uh, since we're here, maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look?
Thanks. If you're ever in the market for anything else, drop on by. Especially if Teep is with you. We'll see you around, okay? And let us know when your filter next needs changing. All the items you can want, straight from the plate. Mm. No matter your needs or your budget. He's a regular. Stock up here, and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. Well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady's a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, she's a good friend of Avalanche, so be nice. Please. Hmm. Can't help but take a little pleasure in their panic. More than that. Apparently, it was done by a terrorist group called Avalanche. This is perfect. Hey, Marl. Got some filters for ya. Tifa, my dear, dear girl. Oh, what's he doing here? Working? Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit, big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest to cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. You'd have more color in your cheeks if you went to bed earlier. Marl's great. She helped get me set up back in the day. You saying they're been gonna here a while now? Five years, wow. give or take. Ain't they short uh, but never mind that. We've got to get you your money. Last stop is the weapon store. Hey, if it isn't Tifa. You here for the filter? <laughs> hey! That last filter didn't do shit! We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! All right. If you could just settle your bill, we'll be on our way. The hell? You charging me for your busted ass goods? My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty please. <laughs> Thank you very much. Seeing as we're done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Well, when will Barra be back with the rest? <sighs> Before we open up tonight. It'll be a while yet, so... What do you want to do? Don't really know. In that case, I've got a suggestion. Want to hear it? If you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? Hmm. Another lesson for life on the ground floor. Yep. Connections get you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connections. How do I start? Hmm. Why not help out the Neighborhood Watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. Yeah, okay. Didn't see anybody at the office, so let's head up top. I wonder, think there's any way they can make our guns a little bit lighter? I could always ask the arms dealers down. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. Speak with our friendly staff to find the perfect weapon for you and your needs. Huh? Hey, 
ain't got nothing for a punk ass bitch like you. Get on out of here. Huh? I ain't got nothing for a punk ass bitch like you. Get on out of here. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. We gotta do something about the monsters on Scrap Boulevard. I'll head on down. Huh? Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Huh? Oh, hey, Cloud. Looking to join the neighborhood watch? That depends. What does this neighborhood watch do? Uh, lots of stuff, really. But our top priority is taking care of any beasts that wander into town. That, and teaching the locals how to defend themselves. Like they say, the only one who will look out for you is you. Cloud's a great fighter, but only we know that. If no one knows him, no one will hire him. Thought if he joined the watch, he could get his name out there. That would work for everybody. Truth be told, we could really use your help. We can't pay you in Gil, but we'll work something out. For example... Aha! What about your sword? I could mod it for you. No thanks. It's fine just the way it is. What? You some kind of purist? I know I'd never pass up a chance to improve my gear. Come on. At least let me show you how it's done. All set? Needless to say, you'll have to try it out to appreciate the difference. Thanks. <laughs> we'll do you one better. Spread the word to everyone who'll listen about the new Merkin town. Between him and Wedge, 
There isn't anyone they don't know. I'll march through the streets singing your praises, even on an empty stomach. So, where are these monsters? Scrap Boulevard. Good hunting. Hey, Cloud, I'll come with. No, I've got this. But you don't know the way, do you? Lead on. <laughs> sure thing. I know these streets better than anyone. Boulevard is out west. Past the barricades, supposed to keep the monsters out. Anyway, we should prepare just in case. So they blew up a reactor. you need. terrorists that bombed the reactor. Oh, thank you. I was supposed to be working top I'm real sorry, bro. I didn't even can't get to work up top. Looks like I'm not So this is all that Some folks use the lot for meetups. Seedy types who like their privacy and don't take kindly to interruptions. Searching for candidates. <laughs> 